Okay, so here's how to fix this minor issue. It's really easy. Go to your browser. I have the link in the description. You just go to the link and you download it. Make sure you have WinRAR though. You need WinRAR. WinRAR is one of the main things you need. Okay, so I also want to show you my computer index so you could see what I mean. Oh, sorry. Um, when you download WinRAR, make sure you have a 32-bit or 64-bit. Yeah, if you don't know, you know you're there. All right. So go to the uh, link and I'll click that uh, link and you just open it. Make sure you have WinRAR. Extract it to wherever you want. I'm gonna put it in my animations hard drive because that's where uh, I I like to keep it. Click OK. I already have it, so I click yes. All right. Then we'll click X. X X. All right. So I'm gonna open up my program files. I think that's where I'm going. I'm narrating, so my bad. Computer. Yep. Program files. Um. Steam, Steam Apps, if you don't have uh, Steam Apps, then Common, and then Call of Duty 4. If you don't have Steam, you will probably have to go to uh, Activision. But what this is, a server cache, is it's a server to find other servers. And usually people have retail versions. Well, the one that comes with Steam is not a retail version, so that's why you have to download this one, so you have a retail version. Alright, so, then you want to go back to where you saved it. I don't know when I am, I'm going slow. Give me a chance here. Alright. So, go back to where you saved it, computer. Um, animations. There. Alright. There it is. Servercache.dat. I'm going to copy it because you're going to need it in about five days. It's going to do the same thing again. You're just going to have to copy it and paste it again. Just do the same thing over if it, whenever it starts giving you servers. It hasn't done it to me in a while, but just did it again. That's why I'm doing this tutorial. So, you're going to do paste, uh, copy and replace. And it should work now. And um, if you get kicked from Punkbuster, tell me. I'll make a tutorial on how to fix that, too. That's easy. Uh, you might have to turn off your Windows Firewall, too. I think I'm going to show you how to do that in a little bit. All right, so now you have the correct server cache. And then you're just going to X out of this. Excuse my Skype. I'm sorry. Uh, as you can see, I'm running... If you want to know how to get that, that's called Rain Meter. It's just a little uh, gadget you can have. It's um, you can get all different themes. This is the only theme you can get. It's just a cool geeky theme I like. Looks really alien technology like. So I have that one. Um, tells you my hard drive, C drive, uh, my two dual cores. Tells me uh, what they're, how high they're processing. Um, you can do all that. I can have my notes. Um, I'm about to go to that here. Uh, I think that's my RAM. Uh, there's my notes. I just click on the 54 right there to edit my notes. Yeah, I know you can laugh. All right, so um, then you can see up there it is sunny outside. Uh, it is um, it is July 8th. It's a Friday, as you can see there at the clock. I don't know if I had video lag. All right, so now, yeah, dual screens. You can tell two alien wallpapers. I'm gonna go over to computer properties. Oh yeah. Um, I'm thinking I'm about to show you my index and show you what's so funny. All right, 4.9, 5.7, 5. .7, 5 uh, I can't read it. 7.2, 7.2. I can't read it right now. But um, as you can see, my 4.9 is a big drawback. I have it overclocked 3.22 gigahertz. So you know, I'm trying to get good frames. I don't get a hot CPU either because I got like a hundred, a 200 millimeter fan and like 500 other freaking 120 millimeter. So you know, I'm rocking with the fans. So then you want to head over to your Windows Firewall. I'm not sure if this makes a difference or not, but a guy told me to. I've decided to do it because I don't need it because I have my antivirus on. So, you know, I turn them both off. Um, yeah, you click that. And, you know, if it's you don't have Windows or Vista, you just go into XP, Control Panel, Networking, Windows Firewall, or maybe it's Security, I don't know, and you just turn it off. All right. So uh, now we're back at the uh, um, game. I hope it works. Yep, there it is. So it did work. Refresh list, waiting for master server. Now I have him back instead of master server, you know, not responding towards me. And if you get kicked out in the game, that's because Punk Buster. And I'll tell you to do that. Uh, here's my multiplayer options. Yes, yes. I um, have my console on and blood. So, you know, there's all my things if you don't know what to do.